I think we always surprise a lot of people, and I know at the end of the season, for Big Tens wise, a lot of people underestimate us, and we always surprise, and I think that's this year's no exception. I'm really excited to see how all this really hard training and training trip and everything and taper all plays out for all of us as freshmen. Ever since I was probably five years old, I've wanted to come to Minnesota and swim here. I have a picture of one of my like goals when I was, I think, 10 years old, and it says, I want to swim for like the Golden Gophers. So being able to really fulfill that, one of my dreams, is super exciting. And now that I'm finishing up my career, it's it feels really good to be able to represent Minnesota. The Big Ten is just loaded um, from top to bottom. Just so many good teams. And it's, it's a really, um, it's a different conference than it was even five years ago where now, you know, you, you know, if you're going to be in the top of this conference, you're going to be in the top of the NCAAs as well. And so I uh, can't wait for the competition and can't wait to see how we fall in. This group is a young group. We've done, done the hard work, come off our training trip and um, come back to, to the University of Minnesota and the attitudes are great and everybody's been performing well, so just now can't wait to, to see it all pay off. I'm really excited to see Kate Sullivan race. Uh, she has had an outstanding season. Um, her freestyles have she's gone in best times almost every race, so just to see her taper and potentially go to NCAAs. I would say I'm really excited to watch Maggie Irwin swim the 500 because in practice a few weeks ago she had a really, really fast stand-up, so just to see her with a full taper and see how she does with that would be really cool. Uh, teammates race that I'm excited for would be Emily Cook. She always just blows everyone out of the water and we never know how fast she's going to swim, so I'm hoping she smacks the water after her race. <laughs>